Paul, thank you. We know Southern California is a great place for foodies, but especially right now because it's also Greater Ontario Restaurant Week. Yes, dozens of restaurants take part. We're joined live by Luis Sanchez from the Chocolate Bar, and we have Betty assisting him today. But tell us a little bit about um, Ontario, Greater Ontario Restaurant Week. It's a little different than Dine LA, where you guys just get to be showcased. Yes, of course. We go call Greater Ontario. It's uh, a showcase that is helping small business restaurants, specifically in the city of Ontario, city of Rancho Cucamonga, and for the next 10 days, the 12th to the 21st, and it's going to be a great opportunity for us to promote the business. That's awesome. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, what do we have here? This is like so decadent. I'm smelling all the chocolate. It smells amazing. And, and it looks someone like you're loves make chocolate. Something. I do love chocolate. I mean, who doesn't love chocolate? Uh, uh, great. You're a chocolate lover. We're a family who loves chocolate, and we incorporate the chocolate into most of the items that we have at our restaurants. We have a dessert bar, and of course, the mainly items for us are crepes. As you can see, all the crepes we have okay. the Nutella crepe with chocolate. We have the tres leches, and she's going to prepare our signature crepe called the chocolate bar crepe. Ooh, it's okay. the, with the fresh fruit, the strawberries, bananas, and it's all covered with chocolate, oh. representing, you know, the chocolate bar. It's chocolate so bar. Bay, are you going to be in heaven? <laughs> process. Uh, yeah. I'm in heaven already, but I think. Also, we have many different options as far as sugar-free crepe, uh, sugar-free chocolates, of course, and we have savory items, as uh, tortas, uh, savory crepes, and of course, many different of the pastries, like this beautiful cheesecake oh, covered cheesecake with looks uh, so good. Uh, strawberries, old-fashioned chocolate cake we have here, and the tres leches. We're trying to embrace our Latino culture. You know, we mix this with, you know, Italian, French, you know, dishes. And, and it's amazing customers having the opportunity to taste different items and have the opportunity to enjoy chocolate and whatever <laughs> yeah, they yeah, want. Everything. We have drinks. And, of course, we have, like, the chocolate or a cafe de olla uh, that we're promoting to as well. Because this is our Latino coffee mixed with cinnamon, a little bit of Ooh. mint. And we have that over ice today for the okay. summertime. Here, Ruta Bay. Uh, you... How did you know? <laughs> this is all about How you. did you know that I was uh, excited? And, about uh, it. Let me you can hear the excitement. Mm. Uh, I see a sandwich up there. Oh, yes. No chocolate in the sandwich, uh, well, I'm assuming. let me tell this you, some amazing. customers want to have chocolate on the they sandwich, do. whether or not. Yes. Okay. <laughs> and uh, it, it's amazing when they, like, again, they see the options that they have um, to pretty much have something and Ooh, enjoy that. it with chocolate. So is there a uh, trick to making crepes? Because it doesn't actually yeah, look that easy. Well, like, that's why we're not doing it. We have yeah, a special yeah, assistance. No. That's why we have Betty. <laughs> yeah, well, it, it, it takes time to learn a little bit about, you know, how to prepare them. And I know it's difficult when you have to set up everything, you know. <laughs> we love I think to, Betty's doing great. We love to do it. It's a family-owned business, Latino own business. Again, Go Cal, it's helping us a lot with this promotion and many other restaurants, but uh, the city of Ontario and Rancho Cucamonga Ooh, are nice. pretty much part of this program. Yeah, and, it's pretty uh, cool because it's, it's it's similar to other events, but it's there's no prefix menu or anything. It's just showing off all exactly, these mom and pop exactly. amazing And it's also having fun, you know, because yeah. we love to show this to our customers, of course, to you. Ho hopefully you can visit us one day yeah. in the city <laughs> yes. of Ontario. I uh, recently opened a second location in the city of Highland. Of course, oh, we love awesome. to be part of the community of the uh, San Bernardino County, Inland Empire, of course. But people from different places, trust me, people traveling to cities like Bieber, coming down from the mountains, stopping in, in Highland, or people traveling yeah. to uh, Palm Springs and stopping. We're at the exit of the 10 Freeway and 6th Street. And so people just go out, have their coffee, have their crepe, and just leave to Palm Springs, to Vegas. You are such so a good amazing. salesman. <laughs> tell, us, tell us what we're doing here. We're looking at the food. so we. We put fruit and nuts in the crate. Yep, yes, that's all been fresh fruit. In. We source this from local uh, mm -hmm. sources, local growers on strawberries over there in uh, uh, Chino, our uh, Ontario area. And uh, they provide us with fresh uh, fruit, and we cover, like, again, this all covered with chocolate. If you love chocolate, Where's the this chocolate is for you. From? Do you have a special uh, chocolate? We have a yeah. source from Mexico. We are from Mexico City, uh, and we are bringing this chocolate from uh, the southern area, Tabasco, Chiapas, so family that grows cacao in there and is uh, doing wow. the chocolate. Well, I taste it in this coffee drink. It's amazing. I know Mexico City is known for its culinary experience. I've never had the chance, so I'm excited to try it here. Oh, yeah. We you have it will here in it, Southern California me. now. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Jamie, do you so, want to try this? No, I'll try the drink while it's you really try the delicious. crepe because this this has your name all over it. <laughs> is this like dessert or is this breakfast? Well, mm. uh, for us, it's oh, a dessert, really but people have goes to the uh, store and have, you know, this with coffee and call it breakfast. So <laughs> <laughs> why not? That's my style. Why not, right? <laughs> so that's, you know, I really feel like the tourism 
board here has given such an opportunity because margins are so thin for restaurants, right? So this yes. is really not only a celebration, but really must help your business. Yes, and again, it's people, locals, and also we are very close to the airport of the city of Ontario. People coming from other countries and stopping and searching yeah. us. We are very blessed to have five stars for the last five years. Congratulations. And, uh, so they find us and they just go and try it and they love it. So now whenever there's they- more chocolate? <laughs> yes, it's oh, more wow. chocolate. I'm getting a little nervous. <laughs> yeah. Excited, so, but nervous. Uh, yeah. What nuts are in here, by the way? Uh, we do have almonds on this one, and on the Rollo Nutella, we have walnuts. So, okay. Yes. So, uh, so you're more than welcome. It's going to stop with us one day. We will take care of you, of course. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I think we'll be coming that way. Um, we have to go, so can we make sure that Rutabay tries this? Yes. Uh, before we go. You want to eat this? Just, just a little, bit just of, a little of powder? The, yeah, powder on yeah. top. Okay. That way you can just make it look there you a go. little nicer. There you yeah. go. Should I just dig in? Yes, yeah. there is some utensils oh, for you there. I was you. wondering how I was going to do this. I was a little All right. concerned. Okay. So, As she's eating there, thank you both so much thank for being you. here today. Yes. Let's, see, let's see what her review is. Let me get a strawberry. Oh, you got to get a here. strawberry in yeah. there. Okay. Good deal? I approve. <laughs> All right. Well, for more she information on Greater Ontario Restaurant Week and how you can take part, just check out our website, kcalnews.com. Click Scene on TV.